Oh, fucking Christ. First time. It's currently free with Xbox Game Pass, so I'll see what I can do with it. Uh, I, from what I've seen, I think it's kind of like Borderlands, which I really enjoy. So uh, this should be fun. I'm not sure. The first thing I want to do is turn down the fucking volume. Seven. Music. Put it on a third. Uh, similar subtitles. Yes. Yes. Uh. Controls. Let me check the buttons right quick. Uh. Quick melee sprint. Uh. Looks about average. All right. Uh, vibration sense. I'll figure all that out later. Uh, let's just story. Use this mode if you enjoy story without combat and story mode. Enemies have less health and less damage. Recommend a mode for your first play session. In normal mode, enemies have standard health and damage. Most players look for extra challenge. Normal mode, enemies have more health and do more damage. Holy shit! Supernova mode is the hardest difficulty and can be so can only be selected by players at the start of the game and is recommended for advanced players. Supernova mode adds additional challenges to the game. If you reduce the difficulty below Supernova, you cannot re-enable it. Alright. Enemies have more health and more damage. Alright. You must eat, drink, and sleep to survive. Companions can die permanently. Crippled body and limb conditions can only be healed with bed rest. Weapons and armor work very poorly at zero durability. You can only fast travel to your ship. You can only sleep inside your ship. You can only manually save while inside your ship and auto saves are limited. I'm gonna go with normal. <laughs> Fuck all that noise. Alright, I'm gonna need to move the stream overlay because it's blocking all of the settings, like all of the selections. But I'm gonna watch the cinematic first. Why stay earthbound when prosperity awaits you in the stars? Come to Halcyon, the only colony on the edge of the frontier owned and operated by corporations. A trip of 10 short years will feel like mere minutes thanks to the comfort and safety of your very own hibernation chamber. You'll wake up in a perfect society designed to maximize your productivity with guaranteed full employment. With only a minor term of service, you will become the master of your own destiny when you go out of this world to the Halcyon Colony. What kind of fucking name is Halcyon? Let's be honest. <laughs> I'll, I'll limit how much I talk during uh, the cutscenes. Hope to be left at Edge of Colony. Alright. Breach of Hope Security Corridor, unidentified ship. Alright. Is that me? Question mark? Uh... Let's go on. Well, <laughs> he looks like Willem Dafoe. Kind of. If he got like a really shitty facelift. Hundreds of thousands of colonists left to drift out here forever just to keep from damaging the board's bottom line. Disgraceful.
Uh, strength. Uh, oh. I hope you're ready to shoulder a burden, friend. I'll do. No signs of muscular atrophy. Or I'll Splendid. do good strength, dexterity, good intelligence. All right. Ooh, let's see what this does. Spaces choice rations. Effective skills: handed melee, or one-handed melee, two-handed melee, heavy weapons, block, inspiration, and intimidate. Uh, eighty kilogram. All right. So I'll do with good strength for now. Uh, dexterity. One-handed melee, all right. Handguns, dodge, block, sneak, and lockpick. Always good. I might actually put that up to high. Intelligence, long guns, persuade, hack, medical, science, and determination. One point there. Perception, handguns, long guns, heavy weapons, dodge, lockpick, and engineering. Good. Persuade, lie, intimidate, hack, science, and inspiration. Shit. All right, what's this? Two hundred melee, uh, lie, sneak, medical, engineering, combination. I'll do one in charm, and I'll do two in dexterity. Next. Uh, points placed in a core skill tree. Melee will increase specialized skills. One hundred, two hundred, up to rank fifty. After fifty, you can have points directly to specialized skills. I bet you're vicious with a toss ball stick. Oh. Uh, I will do range a shot. and Capital. stealth. Uh, select the career aptitude that your character possesses. Each aptitude corresponds to a small bonus. Uh, colonist sounded like a nice entry level career for a person of your skills. Expanding human ideas reached by civilizing... Cosmic Frontier was ambitious. Uh, no, was ambitious enough without worrying about your day job. You had the rest of your life to decide how uh, to be useful in Halcyon. Determination. Dream factor. Uh, block. Persuade. Uh, da, 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 da. A lot da. spread, eh? Huh. We all start somewhere, I suppose. That. That kind of looks like me. I mean, I am white, but not quite that way. I am that eye color. Oh, that's fucking cool. Purple. Absolutely. I'll put that all the way back. About there. Horizontal. What? Uh, Well, my eyes are actually really small in real life. Bit high. I do have a below average mouth size. About there. I, I'm Jewish, so I have a big fucking nose. My nose is actually tilted up. Nose width. Absolutely vertical. Bit down. Cheeks. Big. Hair. Hair style. I just got my hair cut actually, so it's really short. Fucking hell, that actually kind of looks cool. That's a lot closer to my hair, so I really like. Do they have like a bright fucking orange? I mean, that's close. I'll deal with that. I have really small eyebrows. And if I could trim those down a little bit, that'd be me. <laughs> fucking Commodore. <laughs> oh, I can be a fucking Commodore. I can be a red-headed Commodore. <laughs> yes. Okay, Mirage. Fuck. <laughs> I might actually go with that. That one looks really good. Yeah, that that's a lot closer to what I am in real life. I'll, I'll go with the fucking Mirage trim right here. <laughs> Features. Makeup. Oh, fuck yes. Yeah. 
Yeah, Scar. No Scar. Age. Yeah, whatever. Hey, my character's name will be Alex. Yay. That's me. Uh, yeah, I'm really happy with that. Start the game with this character, yes. This fucking cat. Day, my friend. This fucking cat is sitting on the microphone wire. Can you not, you bitch? Alright, she moved. Was he just went onto the ship, kidnapped me, and then ran away? Did I just get fucking kidnapped? Initiate skip jump. I mean, like, thanks for the ship, pal, but you finna die. I I just realized I actually confirmed my character with fucking bright red eyeshadow. <laughs> <sighs> Phineas Wells. Is that Phineas? Where, where, where's Ferb, bro? Where's Ferb? He dead, though? I think he did. Huh? Ah, there you are. Wondering what's going on, eh? A bit of bad news there, I'm afraid. Your colony ship was inexplicable. Knocked out of skip space and forced to complete its journey at sublight speeds. This means that you and every other colonist on the Hope have been in suspended animation for 70 years, give or take. Normally, <laughs> reviving someone after so long leads to some quite horrifying results. It's called explosive cell death, but it's really more of a liquefaction. Something wrong? Does not sound oh, fun. Yes. Well, not to worry. I've pumped your body full of a special concoction I devised to keep you from dying so horrifically. Hopefully at all, but uh, I guess we'll see, yes? Unfortunately, I used the last of my chemical supplies saving you. I know it's a lot to ask, but I must have your help securing more if we're to save the rest of your fellow colonists. I'd see it done myself, of course, but the board has a sizable bounty on my head. Now, my ship is inoperative, but I've managed to hire a smuggler to help you out. He'll be... Oh, I see we're in position. Good luck! Are you about to fucking launch me to his ship? Yes, you are. <laughs> With some more hilarious failure. But, you know, it's whatever. Remember the hope. Chairman Rockwell raises a glass for our lost brothers and sisters. 60th anniversary of the Hope's disappearance. So he, yeah, everyone, like the 1,000 plus odd people on that ship have just been there practically dead for 70 fucking years. Can you hear me? Is this thing working? Ah, there you are. Now, uh, where were we? Barely. Oh, yes, the smuggler. His name is Hawthorne, and he should be waiting for you at the landing site. He's to be your uh, chauffeur, so to speak. And not to worry, I'm told he's a specialist. Dashing gunslinger, one of a kind ship, that sort of thing. You'll like him, I'm sure. I've also outfitted you with a simple wireless monitor, so I can track your progress. I'll check in with you as soon as you land. Good luck. If I'm not I'm fucking dead. Old. What are the chances that someone would actually survive this shit? Can we get like game theory on here? <laughs> of course we have literally zero fucking information. But how he'd make a 10 minute video out of just a picture. Should be close by. 
Or, so when I get a chance, I want to move this stream over there so it's not covering anything and I can see everything. I, told him to I just don't want it to. But only you'll see the game. Not stand there holding it. Oh well, no sense in letting his ship go to waste. Hawthorne won't mind you taking his ship. Better you than the board, huh? Not sure I trusted the fellow. Might have gone after the bounty on my head. Shame about the whole squashing thing. Nasty way to go. Wait, did I fucking murder him? I wasn't paying attention. What's the new saw grass rocks so they're covered to hide from enemies? That ain't good. Magic, bro. Fuck you mean. <laughs> ah! Hey, you. I'm alive. Yeah. You've tried the best now. <sighs> now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Oh, law, that stings. Uh, medical five. Still, I'll patch you up. Oh, what happened to you? Spacer's we were out of what? Control. I saw a marauder camp up in the hills. Thought I could take him. Then you my gun fucking fired idiot. Right through my side. I mean, what are the odds of that, right? Just barely scraped by I'd... with my life. Crawled in here and blocked off the exit with those canisters. Huh. Looks like the bleeding stopped. I owe you one. Hope you don't mind me omitting this little exchange for my report. Spacer's Choice doesn't like us accepting outside help. Yeah, fuck those people. Oh, uh, what's this about marauders? Flesh-eating, law-breaking, unemployed lunatics with guns. Some hull had grounded their spacecraft out in the open. That's right. a real good way to attract marauders. See those canisters by the entrance? Marauders come sniffing around in here, and I can take them all out with a single shot. Not bad, huh? Right, I've got a better idea. Come here, gun, and I'll go help. Lie, some guy out of their ship illegally. I'll hunt them down for you. Oh, you're an idiot. Give me your gun for yourself. Yeah, I'll okay. go with Persuade. You look like you know your way around a gun. Got some spare ammo. Not counting the bullet in my side. Here, you can have my saber, too, yeah. for patching me up and all. This all fucking cat. Now 30% less likely to malfunction. You've tried the best. Now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Yes, nailed it that time. <laughs> I kind of like this guy. Uh, do you know anything about the hope? The hope? Is that some sort of fancy new drug? Are you with anti Cleo or something? Don't take this the wrong way or nothing, but I'm not allowed to fraternize with Cleo workers. Company policy. You I hit where I am. or something? You're in Emerald Vale. Yeah. We're a Spacer's Choice community. Edgewater's a little ways down. Uh, prettiest place in the Vale. Be sure to stop by a provisioner's for a can of our famous salt tuna. Salty tuna, I take. Alright, I have a gun. Damn it, my ears! Ugh. Oh, what just Yo. happened? Can you hear me? What in the hell? This. Wow. Technical time dilation. Two to completion stemming from you being revived after extended hibernation. Your brain processes are. Your brain processes time differently. Pressing the tactical time relation TTD button shows slows down the world, giving you time to think as well as take action. You will have time with this mode, and it still drains your TTD meter very slowly while move uh, while moving. Oh, very slowly while moving and attack straight faster. Uh, okay, the TTD meter refreshes slowly over time. Right bumper. Okay. Oh, 
I mean, that fucking worked gloriously. I need to lower the sense on this thing, bro. Fucking hell. Uh, equip. Uh, settings. Controls. Turn the sense down. 25 game. Uh, yes. Yes. Alright. Uh, uh, damage. Shows how much damage the weapon can cause with a single shot. I'll protect it. That's it. Uh, I like this having one. Uh, uh, okay. I hate how games do that. They zoom in the field of view when you start sprinting. It's so bad. You are a bitch. Oh, that's me dead already. was cool. sound kind of weird to people that don't play console, especially you know, people who don't play console a lot. But this game feels like it was made for PC. That is definitely not a good thing. Aiming with the, aiming with the sticks is kind of awkward. It feels like it jumps really, really bad. I have a fucking assault rifle now. I want to save my ammo. I need to heal. So, there's a person right there. There's two more there. I don't see anyone else. So I'll do a little, Oh, wait, no, there's someone right fucking there as well. Alright, that's four. Anyone else? Uh, doesn't look like. Alright, I'm gonna get a sneak attack.
Uh, corner just you've got enough experience to go up level, open your character, level to advance your character, level up to increase your health points, give you more points to upgrade your skills, as well as give you access to new perks every other level. Keep level the level, and you'll be upper management material in no time. Alright. So I can add points to everything. I'm gonna go with a, another point in tech. Oh, put a bunch of points in tech, I guess. I didn't realize I had a ton of points available. <coughs> kind of just did them. I didn't mean to. Yes. Uh. Uh. I'll go with sprint speed. Uh, what do you got? A sentry saber. Rebuilt mining gear. I didn't get any fucking ammo for this pistol, for this uh, weapon. I'm sad. Uh, what's this? Please be informed that this vessel contains no ah! valuable plunder. It it definitely contains some plunder somewhere. Uh, I believe that's to continue the game, so I'm gonna explore a bit. Intruders are not authorized to access the unreliable's amenities, including the cargo holds workbench. Marauder. Sawed off shotgun weapon part. It's dangerous for your health. Nothing in there. Alright, uh, it feels like jumping, spamming, spam jumping is gonna be the fastest way to move. Please be advised that using the respecification oh. machine will not make you a better person. Marauder, please be informed that the engine room contains nothing of value. Ah, fucking hell. Uh, what's that? That's just a light. Marauder, please be informed the ship has no crew for you to murder. I know All that. doors are on security lockdown. Nice try, Marauder. Please be informed that I am authorized to use I am violent authorized to use violent retribution against unwanted solicitors. Please return any misappropriated equipment and exit this vessel in an orderly fashion. Failure to do so will result in your immediate destruction. Uh, what do you yourself destruct? I'm not here to miss for anything. Uh, I that. elevated heart rate. Indicating dishonesty. Please prepare yourself for lethal deterrence. Jefferson procedures initiated. Disengaging what? Oh, her eyes are open now. Fuck. In five, four, three, two, one. If you are still here, my deception protocols have failed. I have been programmed to express disappointment. <laughs> Look at the face. Look at the face. I need to get the ship of the air. This vessel is the registered property of Captain Alex Hawthorne. I am incapable Fuck of accepting yeah. orders from anyone other than Captain Alex Hawthorne. I uh, it turns out I am Hawthorne. Ha <laughs> ha. Your, your captain is right here on my escape pod. I will require some time to process this information. Thank you for your patience and for your honesty. It is not, and I repeat, it is fucking Hawthorne. not. <laughs> if I accept your orders, then you must be Captain Hawthorne. Do you understand? 
Uh, I got it. I get it. You can be recapped Hawthorne or you can't fly. Okay, but uh, Hawthorne, Hawthorne well is dead. Alright, I'll just be Hawthorne. I see your powers of deductive reasoning remain intact. Unfortunately, She's our smug. is currently inoperable. Early inoperable. Our main drive Fuck. suffered a critical power failure, and we were forced to make an emergency landing. The main drive's power regulator has been irreparably damaged and must be replaced. What? <laughs> I never found it. I'll find a part like that sitting around the, gar the garage. However, the probability of locating a power regulator within a worker settlement falls within acceptable parameters of certainty. High capacity power regulators are sometimes employed in the electrical networks of worker settlements. I have taken the liberty of printing you a new captain's identity cartridge. Please try not to lose it this try not time. To lose it this, time. this cartridge identifies. I'm not fucking Hawthorne. As the registered proprietor and captain, I don't, I don't care. Do you understand? Uh, Best of yeah, luck yeah, I got it. for a power regulator. Try to stay alive this time. All right, so I need to go and. Find a power. You, oh, yay! I'm the Spacer's Choice Department of Human Resources. Town sent me hereabouts to check on the guards. Now, it seems to me, and correct me if I'm wrong here, but seems to me they're all dead. Mind telling me what happened here? Uh, yeah, the guards and I had a bit of an altercation. The guards actually really shot themselves. <laughs> uh,. Yeah, the guards had a bit of an altercation. you say? Yeah, shame as that goes. Spacer's Choice policy strictly prohibits dying during work hours. Guess I'd better get to cleaning up. Can't just leave company property scattered about, bleeding out on the dirt. Is there again a sense of letting it all get to uh, waste? Do, friend. That armor's Spacer's Choice property. Bodies, too. Living or otherwise. Company policy. That's kind of fucked. Seems you don't want to amble on over to Edgewater at your earliest convenience. Constable's office might have work for someone with your, uh, let's just say, aggressive disposition. Oh, and uh, be sure to stop by the Edgewater Provisioner for a can of salt tuna. It's not the best choice. It's Spacer's choice. Yeah, hang on, I want to see something. Uh, I'll be on my way. Can I kill him too? I fucking can. Oh no. I didn't know. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> I try slashing lock, quicking, hacking, and murder are considered illegal. Well, no shit. <laughs> uh, and are frowned upon by society. Avoid being seen if you want to engage in lots of activities without consequences. Alright, well, I just murdered a seemingly innocent man. And he didn't have shit for me to loot. Fucking glorious. Sorry, Ernie. I should have saved. <laughs> Fuck. <coughs> oh, who this? Oh! That guy. That's a bad guys. person oh they're right here they did haha <laughs> there's so much light ammo I don't even want it I need big ammo big er ammo resident resident fucking hell all right let's go There is no in-air adjustment for, for moving. If you're in the air, then you are just in the air and furry. You can't do shit to Whoa, change hey. that. Where'd you come from? 
around. Don't go ambling out in those hills. That's marauder territory, friend. Fred. I'm just passing through my party crash those back there. How do you know I'm not a marauder? You talk too pretty for a marauder. Most of them just grunt and yell. Ain't safe out here. So this is you basically town. better than borderlands. I should say better. I should say low, low yeah. prices. Let's hold so. I never name I'm Alex. Uh, do they pay you to chat with strangers? Miss me, I'm Alex Hawthorne, captain of the unreliable. Is that we got a pair of armed guards? I'll go with why. I'd shake your hand, but I've been hauling corpses. You don't want none of that on you. Name Silas. Junior no, and don't. humor for the town of Edgewater. We're all part of the Spacer's Choice family. Uh, who are I talking to? A power regulator. I only made a little money while I'm here. This place looks like we just fall to pieces. Junior and humor. Fancy hell for a grave digger. Uh, power not regulator. The junior and humor. That's for sure. If you've got business inquiries, you should stop by Reed Thompson. Reed Thompson. He's up in the tower above the cannery. Head into town, follow the road. Look, you obviously ain't right. a worker. What's your racket? You a smuggler? Freelancer? Uh, depends on the work. You offer me a job, do what I want. That's my personal run issue. Edgewater uh, is a company town, board owned and operated. That includes the cemetery. None of us own our grave sites, we rent them from the company. Renting means money. You're money means shitting. Paperwork. Paperwork means signatures. Some of our families become a might delinquent in paying their dues, you see. Well, we collect what's owed to you. Our workers still that. haven't paid up. Phyllis, Conrad, Ludwig, and Martin Abernathy. He's a special case. You may want to twist his arm a little. Alright, uh... Why is Abernathy a special case? I don't want to get into it. Just make sure he pays up. Can I take the money and just leave? Uh, what can Conrad's I find these people? I've got a barbershop in town. Phyllis works Harbor. at the cannery most hours. Cannery. Abernathy. I ain't seen him in a few days. Uh, his domicile, domicile is near the cannery. You'll find him in town. All except Ludwig, that is. He's over by the landing pad. And landing pad. Uh, there's, there's, uh, I'll be back. So I'm pretty sure I could straight up Come in here, uh, use my time dilation, stagger and blind th all three of them, and then just go on a mass fucking rampage in the town. I'm not gonna do- actually, uh, save game. You save. Load game. Right there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go right fucking here. Blind, blind, and blind. Holy shit! Holy shit! <laughs> uh, assault rifle, it's probably some ammo. A dervish mist. And, uh, heavy, uh, I do fucking need that. Oh, my God. All right, let's, here, I'll loot these guys. And I'll continue. If I start getting attacked in the town, then I'll, I'll load the save. All right. Uh, what's going on over, over here? I might be able to, uh, if I don't get caught, they might just think, oh, that was just murder from those fucking marauders probably came here and shot them. Although one guy got blown to bits, so he probably got like hit by a, th hit with a fucking grenade or some shit, but you know, it's, it's whatever. <laughs> those were all ra rather higher level characters. Like, I with a gun, I was like level 5 or some shit like that. So I'm surprised I was taking that that easy. But I did get a ton of heavy ammo. And that actually goes a long way. It's better if you burst it correctly. <sighs> so as it is right now, the stream overlay is actually in a good, rather good spot. So, 
So it seems no one in town is aware of the mass fucking murder that just took place outside. That is good. Let's keep it that way. Another day at the cannery. Don't go knocking your work. At least we've got work. I mean, that's something. What's going on here? I've been feeling pretty low these days. Nothing I can do about that. I can help with that. Uh, there's something I can do with it. It's called a fucking gun. <laughs> uh, more people. Oh, what's this? Ooh. Did this thing kill me? I fucking hope so. What's this? Oh, it's a workbench. Oh my lord. I literally have three fucking assault rifles. No, I saw that sawed off shotgun that I haven't added to my weapons yet. Uh, what I'll do is I'll do. Bang. Nope. Sawed off pistol. Not pistol. Melee. Assault rifle. I have a shit ton of shotgun ammo, man. And a big ass horde. Who Wilson? Just between us, Wilson deserted. Lost his nerve. Ran off in the <laughs> Hey, fucking Wilson. I can go kill him. Always thought he was made of sterner stuff. I think he was plagued. Guess he didn't want to die in the sick house. Plagued? Ah, oh, shit. I had some of this all tuna. You moron. Hi, is, is am I free to murder you yet, or do I have to wait for that? Well, actually, now that that guy is dead, I could probably take the money and keep it, right? Uh, what's this? Terminal. I'm gonna play for like an hour, hour and a half. Get a good, good sense of what this game is. But so far, I'm actually really enjoying it. Argo, I'm sorry, Mr. Thompson, sir. You asked why it's taking so long to fix. The answer's technical. Don't apologize. Just try using small words for me. The cans bust open in the oven because she's set to cook saltuna, which isn't what we've got. Mr. Thompson, I think there's someone here to see you. Focus, Miss Holcomb. You and I are still talking. Seems we've got a I guess. will shoot you. Really now, Parvati, I do wish you'd spoken up. I do apologize. I was given no forewarning of your arrival, or I might have welcomed you at the gates myself. I really wish you had. Uh, are you Miss... Are you Rita? So let's talk to you, Mr. Tom Buzz. I'll wait you till you're finished. Miss Holcomb. It's just what Bess needs is a proper refurbish. I, I, I can bandage her up and what all, but she's just... Old. Sorry, I I'm sorry. I'll I'll do better. And I do wish you'd stop referring to our cannery as Bess. Personification of company property is strictly contrary to the Spacer's Choice Code of Conduct. My apologies. I am not in the habit of I'm in the, the habit of witness such a Fuck row. You. Now, what can I do for you? Uh, are I'm you read? Outposted yes. I cannot help but notice you are not in uniform. I'm not one of you. Of course not. I don't have that kind of luck. Seems I allowed my excitement to run away with my wits. Been a few seasons since we've had a visitor pass through. What's your producer's producer? Only regular power regulator? God is hooked up to the town transformer. Mr. Tobson ain't liable to be keen on dismantling it. I beg your pardon. I am most emphatically not keen on any such thing. I can't let you have our power regulator, but I happen to know of another one, and I happen to know exactly how like you may retrieve guy. it without frying yourself in the process. Uh, There's a power let's regulator in the old botanical lab. It's mostly abandoned, so all that power is being squandered. Go down to the geothermal plant, reroute power from the botanical district over to us. Once their power shut down. You can have their regulator and be along on your way. 
Uh... I was not entirely sure how to tell you this. The botanical labs are not legally inhabited, but there are people who live there. What a surprise! I never would have guessed. I don't think these people will take kindly to losing their power. You mean marauders? Marauders aren't people. You mean marauders? Marauders aren't people. Oh, uh, yeah. I will... Is that clock actually... It fucking is. The people living in the botanical labs. They're deserters. They're deserters. Former workers. Farmer workers. I need workers. them back at ah. their posts. I need them to come home. Tell me what I need to do. My hope is that by cutting off their power, you will convince those deserters to come back to town. Before you go to the plant, I want you to stop by the botanical lab. Speak to their leader, Adelaide. Tell Adelaide. her the power's about to go. And that it's time her band of deserters came back to town. There it is. See what I can do to help you. My dad told me all about the plant. Taught me all he knew. I could come in useful. I mean, if that's all right with you, Mr. Thompson. Sir. I hesitate to part. I'm going to bring her with me. Holcomb, but I cannot deny that she is talented. And may prove useful to you. You will need an administrative passcode in order to enter the plant. I am trusting you with mine. And trusting Miss Holcomb to guide you if you'd like. I will die. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't need help, Great. but I'll take it. I got my wrenches and diagnosticators and hairpins and engine tape, so I'm all set. Well, I am glad to hear that. Best of luck to you. Best and thank you again you. for your help. It is a lot to ask of a stranger, I know. Best of luck to you. It is a lot to ask of a stranger, I know. But I don't fucking care about if you live or die. All I care about is my people and the fact that they survive. So you can go die while I stay here and live. Be right there. Hey, mister, can we talk? Sorry. Got a sec? Sorry, I. You just, just want to get out of here. want to get out of here. And you likely don't want to. Likely don't like want to take a long way. It's just, Mr. Ah. Thompson has his own view on matters, on account of it's his job and and what all. But that's not the only side of the tale. To Mr. Thompson, a person's a gear. It does its job quiet like. If it squeaks or stutters, it gets replaced. The deserters are decent folk. I knew some of them before they left. You can't blame anybody for my leave. The town's got issues! Like him! <laughs> How well do you know the deserters? You work with them, were you were friends, or what? Uh, did you know this Adelaide Reed mentioned? I'm sure the deserters are fine people, are very fine people. So what? <laughs> When you say it like that, it sounds very aggressive. Yeah, they're, they're probably good. And uh, I don't know that anybody. One. Well, I mostly listened to them talk, kept my head down. There was a boy named Thomas who used to follow me around, asking questions about the stuff I fixed. He was real sweet to me. Not any sort of dissident. Uh, Life's hard there. here. Especially for them that don't fit in so well. This town's got issues! The one choice like, family, fuck. But every family's got the one the rest whisper about. Mr. Thompson's aiming to take away their power. They'll have no lights to see, nor heat to cook. They'll be at the mercy of marauders, or worse. I think you should talk to the town's vicar about it. Max, his name is. Uh, as well as you get hurt, we'll stop by. What do we need to talk to Vic to the vicar about flipping a switch in your power bell? Where would I find him? I'll think about it. Bitch. Okay. Uh, yay. I'm on my way. Oh, you're right. Fuck. You are on my ass. 
you are in my, you are on my ass, like, so, like, a pair of cheeks. That, that's very, very strange, a very, very old thing to say. But it's true. This dude's on my ass, like, a pair of cheeks. Because you can't really fucking deny that, can you? <laughs> Which is protein based worker needs. Salt tuna. It uh, like I'm saying, it's probably just like really salty fucking tuna. It's also edge water and the term edge water is well, water's edge, which usually contains a uh, much higher uh, count of salt than regular seawater. So I don't know why or how I fucking know that and I shouldn't, but I do. That's the bullshit you learn in school, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, fucking Christ. Bitch. Died. I died. I didn't mean to die. Continue. I don't want to say that. A canid experiment. Or examine. It's a fuck. <laughs> yeah. So, what you're saying is it is a really large fucked up dog. Got it. They do it as a fucking pancreas, Jesus Christ, they went really in depth with that. I mean, like, look at that shit, you can see, uh, you can see that this Kanan, I think, literally has a fucking pancreas. <laughs> Uh, wrapped it on biological overview. This thing does not. It doesn't look like it has a liver. It, it's just lungs and intestines and a stomach. And you can see its asshole. You can, you can literally see its ass. That's It's highlighted by the number 17. This thing got booty. I mean, shit, got a tail, that kind of booty. That up to you. Not a peep for me. No, the fucking cat's back. That, I wasn't even touching the right stick when it followed. That, that's stupid. <laughs> Looking it up on this fucking box here. Nope, it, it's literally blocked by an invisible barrier. Broader here. Bang, dagger, cripple. That goon got fucked. Why? Ripple. That's the last of them. Really? Fuck, that was effective. What about you? Here, we'll do it home. Cripple and stagger. Fuck. 
I dead ass punch that guy in the face. Fucking hell. Die! Shit. Ow. Where are you? Where the fuck is the party? Oh, wait. Is she fucking dead? Oh. Hi. There's a mission back there, I take it that's just the money collection. Here they come! Break you! Line. Triple. Hit it in the grass. Die again. <laughs> body. No, that's just right. Uh, body is weird. Oh, no, there it is. I don't repair. I have a light machine gun. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun. This shotgun is fucking worthless. Light assault rifle, assault rifle. There's the regular assault rifle. Oh, I'm finna use this bitch. There you are, you useless cunt. I have 10 points. I'm going to put 5 into range. Hannigan's doing way too good. Uh, I'll do 2 there. 2 there. And then I'll do 1 more in leadership. I don't know you. Whatever you're looking for, it ain't here. Move along. Hey, what's your problem? I'm looking for Adelaide. I need some answers. I'm leaving. Bitch. <laughs> answers, huh? You must be one of those You must be one of those philosophicals. Already got ourselves one of those. I'm looking for the geothermal plant. Know anything about it? Reed said something about a former workers living in the wilderness. 
I'll get out of your hair. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll get out of your hair. Uh, Geo, Geo what? Look, plants ain't my purview. Plants ain't my purview. You're better off asking plants after ain't my purview. If you're gonna start wandering around my camp, know that I got no, my sights on you. I got my you. sights on you. That sounds, uh, read. Yeah, that's that. us. And you can tell Thompson we're doing just fine by ourselves. Enough with the questions. Yeah, no offense, <laughs> but I've got a lot on my mind. I can help with that. Uh, we've all got problems. I just got shot in space. You and me both. I'm gonna figure out how the fuck I'm gonna repair my ship. Trouble with marauders? I'll get out of your hair. Explains oh, why one. you're still yammering on at me. No, I'm sorry. That was unworthy of that me. That was unworthy of Lady me. Lady named Zoe went Lady missing some Zoe went ago. missing some nights ago. And just and just ended up. Oh. Now All I'm right. That's around, a, wondering if marauders got the marauders got to her. Uh, keep an eye out. You can always go looking for her. I've crossed off my share of marauders. This ain't about this them. Ain't about them. I go looking What's for Zoe. I leave the camp undefended, seeing as I'm the only one of us who knows her way around the gun. Hence my dilemma. How about fuck the rest of these people? Could be. Dangers are plenty out there. No telling why marauders would steal somebody like Zoe. <coughs> no useful skill as far as I can tell. That's rude. Any chance you can point me somewhere specific, not just out Marauder there. Marauder gang just moved into the districts a little ways east. Their numbers are growing. Gotta come from somewhere. Yeah, the, but the face is moving away when they're talking out like it. It's not like Zoe out. to go wandering. Figured she might be, out, she might be out scavenging. That ain't exactly her talent. Can't imagine where she's gone. Vale's a wide place. She could be anywhere. Uh, don't Appreciate worry about it. it. I'll find her. Honest. Uh. Hey, uh, Pavardi. Fucking hell, you are standing really close. Want to murder this bitch? I kind of want to murder this bitch. And she's gone. Ah, there she is. Uh, skill points available. What? Oh. Fuck you, Adelaide. If you're hungry, there's meat turning on the spit outside. If you're bearing illness, find a place to lay your head down and I'll fetch you a poultice. Whatever your troubles with Edgewater, leave them at the gates and be welcomed here. Any questions, dear? You are an old ass hag. You must be Adelaide. And just who are you now? I am not here to join your camp. Now that you mention it, you don't have the look of an indentured laborer about you. Not nearly enough despair in your eyes. You must be Adelaide, and just who are you? I have been called that, among other things. Green thumb, grandmother. Gra a strange grandmother. Lady who keeps flowers. But yes, Adelaide will do just fine. You can call me your grandmother. Miss McDevitt? Sorry, it's just, you got such pretty trees in here. Why, thank you. You're Robert's girl, aren't you? I remember when you were but a sprout. Thomas speaks of you often. Are you staying long? You should try some of my tobacco tea. I brew it in an old tobacco, but it's been cleaned. The fuck is tobacco? 
Uh, reach out, make peace with you. It's just a great house. Looks to me to help you. Sounds like here. Thompson, you here on behalf of that cold-eyed reptile? Let's hear it. What's Reed's idea of peace then? Uh, you're living off power that belongs to the town. You come back to the cannery. That's about it. Reed asked you to consider coming back to the town. He's willing to make amends. So coming back to the town, you're losing power. Or what's really listening? I can't say I blame you. Reed is positively soporific. I and my own are living just fine out here by ourselves. I might. Reed asked me to divert your power over to him. He mentioned a geothermal plant. This is serious. I'm about to cut off your power. Do I be the asshole or do I be the good guy? I kind of want to be the asshole because it's going to work better. You're doing this for Reed? Why? Uh, you can't pass power regulator. I didn't turn my ship. It's the only good thing to get my reasons on my own. Cannery's got a regulator. You want ship parts, you ought to rip them out of the cannery's guts and leave us be. I might just fucking plant, do that, actually. You should divert power away from Edgewater and toward our end of the grid. Ooh. Think about it. You'd be liberating an entire town from a lifetime of service to that odious cannery. I so can divert the power and then go kill, be. uh, Reed. Uh, what have you got against town? The only thing that makes me a problem is going to affect my ship. A hero to you, maybe. A hero to the people who matter. To us. To the ones who come to around. To the ones who come around. To the ones you to save. To the ones you save. Reed will never understand. He has been too long inebriated on the wine of corporate culture. All he sees is productivity, output, profits. I'll consider it. You think Reed's trying to spite you? Uh, let's say I help you. What happens Life to Edgewater? Edgewater grinds to a halt. The cannery shuts down. Workers desert in droves. And our own little camp grows and thrives. Can I make her a deal where I just, like, divert all power back to the cannery and then go murder Reed? Because I, I can do that. I I'll consider it. you will listen to your conscience. Uh, yeah, I'll divert all power to her. And then just go murder Reed. Uh, where do I need to go? That way. Anything else I can rob? Can I just... I can be, well, I can murder her. This ain't no fucking Fallout. Fuck that game. In this game, you can deadass murder any fucking one you want. Oh, Jesus. Thanks, cunt. Uh, no, that sort of, no, it's, uh, there it is. Shock Cannon. Fuck that sword, you go there. Ooh, big gun do hurty. I take. Big gun do a big hurt. That makes you do a big sad. I'm just robbing everything here. Where the fuck do I go? I am lost as a fucking bat with eyes. Oh, that's Thomas. He used to follow me around before he left the cannery. Oh, right, workbench, where? Right there, right fucking here. Let's fucking go. Uh, 
I have an impact. Why? That's not a fucking weapon I have. Oh! A four, four. Utility, utility. Uh, cell skills plus five. Alright. Lockpick, but oh, these are all the same. Armor mod. Oh. Fucking hell. This fuck I'm I swear to god I'm about uh, ten minutes away from doing this cat ow You mother fuckers Ah oh, Jesus Absolute assholes. I'm gonna follow the river. So this seems to be one of the first 100% free will games. I mean, I haven't played a hell of a lot of Skyrim, but from what I've seen, it doesn't like super open. You can't really just go around murdering people for fun. The game is rather linear in comparison. Yay! Processing. No. Alright. Big Let's gun do the big hurdy. Hoo <laughs> ha ha. Big gun make big hurt. Make people do big sad. Well, that's the thing. Great Casper's ghost. Shit's powerful. Look at this. I am really enjoying this. What the fuck is a flywheel? Or why do I have one? Sister. Well, I have to get the party but What nice is work. it? Joint actuator. I bet. What the fuck? Alright, this game is really fucking fun. Obsidian Entertainment did... Ow, oh, I fuck... Did some really fucking good work on this game. Cause they, what else have they made? Let, let, let's look it up. What what else have they made? Pillars of Eternity, South Park, Sick of Truth, 
uh, Star Wars and Knights. Oh my god. Armored Warfare, Dungeon Siege 3, Neverwinter's Night, Neverwinter Nights 2, Wasteland 2, Sky. I mean, Skyforge? Shit. Pillars of Eternity, Armored Warfare, Armored Warfare. They have made some really fucking good games. They even made Fallout New Vegas, which is widely regarded as the best game. Control room should be ahead somewhere and a touch to the right. Not ever, but I mean like the best swallow game. Nice one. Yeet. That's the last of them. I mean I fucking hope so, Jesus Christ. You you we ain't found shit! <laughs> I wonder what this thing is. Kinda looks like, kinda, I think it works like a tap on the test play, but I ain't too sure. Redirect power. A warning safety feature is detected. I look at a monitor if you're starting to damage. Uh, exit. It says I read power, but something else happened. I didn't notice. Okay, so this is where I make the decision of where I send the power I take. Sealed. Well, why the fuck would you do that? Hacking and picking up. I mean, it's just. What'll happen to Miss McDevitt's folk? If we... uh. Wow, this thing is powerful. And the ammo is fucking plentiful. We made it. Go away, Phantom. There's someone in here, and they've gone fucking crazy. So we're going to make a choice of as to who gets the power. Hey, Is there not a fucking hacking minigame at all? Mind the steam. You're liable to get scalded. If we send the power to Miss McDevitt, what happens to the rail? Incoming! Ow! Ow! Fucking Christ! Get away! Not real. You're not real. Uh, there's someone down there losing their fucking mind. Got it. So there seems to be to be a sliding mechanic or a. A really, a really interesting moving mechanic, moving mechanic, like no one who knows who I or who I am and what I do will know that I really, really like Titanfall. And one of the main reasons I really like Titanfall is the movement. The movement is super fast, super, 
super, super fast, super high pace, super intricate as well. So it's like with Titanfall, you, with Titanfall, you can move a million miles an hour if you know what you're doing. And for spending literally six thousand hours playing Titanfall 2, I got fast enough on controller and on mouse and keyboard. To be able to move really fucking fast 100% of the time. I'm not sure what the ride is. All I know is the decision's final. So do I not get to make a decision? Is that just like... I may have been very wrong about this game. It seems like all the power is going to... Uh, Veil. So they did make a game back in 2018 called Pillars of Eternity 2 Dead Fire. And from looking at it, it actually it looked. Uh, it looks like fucking, uh, uh, what is it? I literally have to my tongue. Is that fucking, uh, third person shooter tower defense game? Can't remember what it's called, but it's like right fucking there. I played it a lot. Protocol back in 2010. This game is very highly rated. A lot of Obsidian Entertainment's games seem to be the same. Like first or third person shooter. Some of the games are top down, like uh, Pillars of Eternity. But you see, you you want you want to see something? Obsidian Entertainment changed Fallout forever, because before Fallout New Vegas. The games were like top down point and click adventure games. Which, yeah, they were fun. But the fucking first person shooter high action games are so much better. Oh my god. <laughs> they probably never would have made a first person shooter Fallout game if it hadn't been for Obsidian Entertainment making it for them. And show you them, hey, this is how you should make this game. It works a lot better. And then they finally just uh, realized, yeah, uh, people didn't like that. So let's fucking copy it. Let's, let's try and do it and fail. Didn't mean to buy that. You cunt. The fuck is a telescoping staff? 51 damage. Jesus Christ. I'll be right back.
Ready when you are. That's cool. That is really cool. Boy, AFK, you get this fucking spinny third person camera. Which most games have this, especially for consoles, to prevent the screen from timing out while people are playing. Once we oh. this, hey, mister. Look, I know you want well, your look, power regulator. I know regulator you want your all. power regulator and all, but I just gotta ask you. I just gotta do ask you. you understand what you're about to do? Absolutely. If you're sure, I just I had to ask. Uh, continue. Quick and the dead. Tackle that my laser charges and Marie. Oh. I made the choice and I did the thing. The fucking lab now has all the power. Fuck the town. I am really fucking hungry right now. That is a fucking... That is a giant praying mantis. That thing is terrifying. And it's like 60% stomach. Look at that. It also has six lungs. Yeet! Yeet! Thank you. Let's see you fucking do. You're a bitch. I did all that fucking sweet parkour and she just teleported to me. That's a mine! Yeah. Ow. Zero G brew. Bag pick. Thing. Oh, two more mag packs. That was quick.
That's a big thing. fucking ammo. That didn't work. I had no fucking ammo. I couldn't do shit. I couldn't do shit. Check my fucking messages, bitch. Uh, fucking Facebook. Facebook takes forever to load. Melly Mendez. This bitch it lives in fucking Argentina. And she sent me a friend request, but she's a damn good artist. I died really far back. Ah, fucking tits. Oh, fuck it. I'll add her. I don't even know what fucking language that is, bro. Cool ass picture. Uh. Okay, I need to do some more stick parkour to get the fuck out of this plant again. Yeet! <laughs> What are you finna do, cunt? Now that I'm looking at you. That's what I fucking thought. Bitch. Okay. Oh, that's what that is. That's really fucking cool, I'll be honest. And you can go in any direction other than forward. That's fucking cool. Legend was best joking. <laughs> Heath Ledger was unabashedly the best joker. But that it's true.
Yeah, I'm not. I. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with this one. Yeah. Ah! Ah! Shit! Ah! Something here behind me before I can react. Ah, this game, bro. Fucking hell. I go back into town and everyone's pissed. Like, everyone is fucking mad, bro. one guy whose name was John Liu and one of my old teachers told uh, she she was British and she was like yeah John come here for a minute I want to talk about uh, your name she's like w w what about it this is like this is back in like the second day of school she's like yeah hey, hey, John come come here for a minute I want to talk about your name he's like w what about it he's like well then you know you know how people call the loo or the toilet the loo right he's like well I've heard that yeah well, who else called the uh, toilet the John? So he's like, my name is Toilet Toilet. I was like, uh, yeah. <laughs> Seems not fucking right. Bitch! Die! Die! Fucking die! Fucking hurt, bro. Yeah. Do you have any ammo, you bitch? You had a fucking peacekeeper? What is that? A uh, long gun. So I'm gonna get rid of that pistol. That didn't do shit. I have Reed's key. Ah, hi there. Thanks for the loot, bitch. Ah!
So my companion is fucking dead. Which is, let's be frank, not good for me. Oh, she's not dead. She's right fucking here. How do I get down? Where, where do I go? Where do I go to get down there? Probably find that fucking elevator, right? Well, you fucking think so, mate, but I can't find the damn thing. It's probably like right here. Isn't it? No, that's sealed. Yeah, fuck these people. They attacked me first. How do I get down there? Now that I kind of murdered everyone. And I can't really open the door. Have I soft locked? I think I might have soft locked. Continue, return to root, uh... That was fucking helpful. On the contrary! Uh. Where do I go? Bitch! Is there like something obvious that I'm missing? Like it just says down and I don't know how to get down there. Heading back. This is not sealed. Everything is sealed. These are vending machines, but they aren't on. Uh, yeah, I have no fucking clue what's going on. Have I broke in the game? Have I actually kind of fucked up? I've always felt weird in here. Here they come! legs came flying off fucking violently, bro. I think the ragdoll in this game is fucking amazing. Never change. That was a nice one hit. This shit is powerful. What do I do? Where do where do I go? Someone fucking knows what to do. I Are you out of your mind? Uh, you just you just killed him. Mr. Thompson. Reed Thompson, you know my boss? I can't. I need to leave. I need to get away from here. I need to get away from you. Uh, 
Uh, Ray was really garbage. I was trying to protect you. Give me a break from our body. We were just telling our differences. Then this is goodbye. Take care. Get lost for our body. I don't need you. You killed Mr. Thompson for talking down his nose at me. You got a real twisted sense of chivalry, you know that? Let's just... Let's just move on. I couldn't forgive myself if I let you loose upon the veil unsupervised. Hey, fuck you. So did I actually just murder Thompson? Is he out here somewhere? Zack, reloading. Fuck. That was almost really fucking cool. Take cover. Damn it. Uh, totally. Titus and Droidicus with Burbage 2000 and Burbage 3000. Hey, 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 hey. Back off. Ooh. So how do I actually get down there? There's like door sealed off and I can't I literally can't even turn this on because there is no power in this place. Bang. What? That didn't kill you? What kind of shit are you made out of? I'm having issues with this game right now. I'm going to figure that out. If you guys want to see me play more of this game, hit the like button down below. And I will definitely be sure to come back and play more because this series is actually dummy fun. But in the meantime, I hope you all enjoyed. If you're new around here, subscribe for almost any videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.